the word part of arguably the most emotional story on the show so far. It was really great Really, story really line. dark, but so, yeah. so amazing. How early did you know that that story was coming, and how did you feel about it? Over the course of the story, even. Mm, I didn't know. I didn't know that that story element was coming until probably the eleventh or twelfth episode. Oh, so after you already got attached to these two gorgeous little girls, and then you have. And and I think even then, I think it was not until. Um, it, yeah, not even then. I don't. I didn't get the script until they were shooting thirteen. That was the fourteenth episode. And yeah. how did you read it alone? Did they warn you it was coming? Was it just when you got the script? I always read them alone. Yeah. yeah. Tears? I was bawling. Yeah, <laughs> it was heavy. So heavy. How was the atmosphere on set for that day? Oh my god, it was it was it was um, it was amazing. For the whole shoot it was amazing. The the children were awesome and um, they, it, we, we kind of kept it really, really light, you know, until we were shooting the scene, and it's such a heavy scene when we broke, you know, to set up a new a new camera setup or something. There was such lightness, you know. The girls, the girls were just awesome. They're just like, you know, great character, have fun, sorry, and. Um, Joking around. Had, I would say arguably one of the exactly. biggest story arcs oh over the show. I know a lot her. of shows I've seen on television. <laughs> Where do you see Carol going? How can she arc anymore? Or where would you like to see her? Where would I like to see her? I don't answer questions like that. I just don't. But, you know, I, I, I'd like to see her survive, obviously, as long as possible. And it's... There's always something to, there's always something happening, you know? And something that always, a catalyst to always change these characters, change relationships, change the way they see themselves, change the way they see the world, see themselves in the world. Do you have a favorite season that you shot so far? Um, there's so much of four that I loved, and there's something about every season that I've loved. Yeah. One of the great things, what I really liked about the second half was with everybody so spread out, you really got a lot more interaction, especially with characters that didn't really interact a hell of yeah, a lot. Yeah, that was one of my favorite things, too. Yeah, so how was that, just working with such a small crew when you've been used to going, you know... You kind of miss, you get a little more time off. <laughs> out of sight, out of mind. There's a little bit of that concern, but then, you know, you, it was fun going to set and watching some of the stuff being shot. Um, but I, I think it was just created such an interesting dynamic to see for the story and for the characters to pair up some that we, that we hadn't seen together, who hadn't, didn't, we didn't know the relationships that well that had developed off screen. I, th I thought I enjoyed that element. I, I liked it. And then you start to miss them. You know? How long was it filming over that area? Which? The whole. Well, the, sec the back half. So, how long were you all really that separate? Because you're not even back with the rest of the group yet. <laughs> um, from what we've seen. Yeah, it's, it's seven months to shoot the entire uh, season. So, yeah. It's, that's a lot of time to be away, but it's a lot of time to, to, and it was fun too to be able to watch the show because there was a lot of stuff I didn't get to see shot. So it was, I love watching this cast. I love watching their work, you know. Well, and then, like I said, you are you and Tyrese and the baby are basically the only ones not in that train car. <laughs> not in that train car. Oh, that's let's. Well, done. <laughs> no. Who knows? There's other train cars. It's, uh, there's well, a, and that's one of the fun of things that you never people know. are speculating. Because you see Carol and Tyrese walking, and there's a fire in the background. But what is that fire? Is it the, the house that Beth and oh, Daryl set on? Up? Yeah. yeah. Is that the house Beth and Daryl are on? You know, it was never established. I mean, nobody came up and said, that's the house that... No, it was never established, so... Which is kind of the fun thing. You can play with different timelines right. a little bit. The, the, the timeline is not that clear, so you know they could have made it to Terminus. <laughs> I don't know. You started out on the show, season one as kind of one of the background characters. You become a lot more prominent, and the fans are now loving you. Um, how, how has that been as an actress to experience the more fan attention of Carol's art? 
I think it's I, I think it's great. I have more followers on Twitter, I guess, but it's it's really not any different than. Um, it just feel it feels good whether I have one fan or you know five hundred or. 230,000. It all feels good. Yeah, it feels good. I'm just, I'm very grateful. Whether I have one or, or lots, it doesn't matter to me. Thank you. Thanks for talking.